what I eat when I want quick, easy, but still healthy meals on very busy days. I'm back with another what I eat video, but this time it has a theme to it. Basically, the situation is that I just moved to another apartment, still in Paris though, but between that, the time it takes to settle in, all the things we have to do related to that move, and also the fact that we're still missing like half of our kitchen appliances and stuff, my meals have been extra quick and easy these past few weeks. So I thought it might interest you to see a few of them so that it can help you get some ideas for when you want to make very simple, very fast, but still mostly healthy meals. And these are actually very quick and easy meals and they require very minimal cooking. And I really insist on that point because I see videos that claim to give you easy meals, but then when you actually look at it, it's like this 50 step recipe and these ingredients that are like, so impossible to find they're so rare you have to like sell your your kidney to get to get one but the counterpart to that is that these are not going to be the most beautiful instagramable meals they're just quick easy simple mostly healthy not that beautiful looking but that's fine and also these are vegetarian so feel free to adapt them to your diet of course and now let's get into the meals so for this first meal i had some multi-grain bread and ice bread cashew nut butter on that and cut up a couple of figs with some vanilla soy milk. Next I had this different whole wheat bread which was absolutely delicious. And I spread some hummus on that, that was homemade hummus that I made um, just before, I'll show you that later. And it's already seasoned. And then I had half a grapefruit. So this is me actually making that hummus. So I put in two cans of chickpeas, a ton of olive oil, salt, pepper, and garlic powder. And then for the rest of the meal, I needed all of these ingredients, so tomatoes, corn, black beans, salad, and cheese, and it's to make these wraps. So I'm spreading the hummus on the wrap, and then I'm going to be adding the rest of the ingredients. This is so quick and easy and you can put whatever ingredients you want in there. And I had a vanilla soy yogurt for dessert. I didn't have that entire thing. Another meal I had were some gnocchi, 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 I have no idea how to pronounce that. I'm also cutting up some tofu, this one has herbs, it's delicious. So then I'm adding tomatoes to the gnocchi with green beans as well. These are, were both canned, so that makes it much easier, much less cooking and prepping to do and still tastes delicious. And then another meal I had was the spinach. Again, frozen spinach makes it much easier. Put that in the microwave and then again sweet potatoes that are already pre-cut in cubes so you don't have to nearly chop your hands off trying to cut them and then this bulgur and buckwheat patty and the sweet potatoes I put salt, pepper, garlic powder, and olive oil. And that's a spinach which currently looks pretty uh, disgusting, let's be totally honest. So I'm adding some salt, pepper, and ricotta cheese to it. There's only about three-fourths of the ricotta left in there. I've been in my I've 
Conversation secrets in your heirloom. And that's another really easy, quick meal to make and some dates for dessert. So those are a few of the meals that I had this past week. Hopefully this was helpful and gave you some ideas. Don't hesitate to share your quick, easy meals in the comments. As you know, I like to use my videos as opportunities to get some messages across. So the message for this video is sometimes life happens and you're very busy and there's lots of things that you have to do and your meals aren't always gonna be perfect. They're not always going to be super balanced and healthy and look beautiful and that's totally fine. Hopefully this video showed you that a meal can be pretty healthy and balanced and still very very quick. But also I want you to remember that if you're having an extra busy day or week or whatever and you're just not able to cook anything and you have to order takeout or just eat bread or eat whatever go eat out that's totally fine once in a while it's it's absolutely fine and you don't you shouldn't be obsessed with having these perfectly healthy balanced meals all the time it's not going to ruin your progress if you do this for the certain phase of your life where you're really busy um you know it's better to to eat something that isn't the the best in terms of health and balance than to eat nothing and to just starve yourself so please make sure that you are always fed even on very busy days and it doesn't have to be perfect. That's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like it and subscribe and see you on my next one. Bye.